Hi folks, this is Tony for a minute to midnight.com. Please, if you haven't already done so, make sure you subscribe to us at our website by going down the right hand side and entering your email address where it says subscribe to blog. That way you'll get notified of all of our shows and articles and so forth. Uh, first off, I just want to say sorry to people that I haven't had a chance to answer on emails and so on in the last few weeks. I've been overloaded basically and haven't been able to get back to lots of people. Um, So just my apologies uh, on that front. Um, What I want to say here in this video, if you haven't already woken up to what's going on, if you need something to show you that we are seeing a sinister rolling out of an end times agenda and I think it's the agenda that we see rolled out in the book of Revelation at this point. If you're in denial, perhaps some of what I'm going to show you here may uh, get you to see things a little differently. We know that the beast system is to arise and I believe it is fully arising at this point. And I just want to start by reading a couple of little scriptures here. We see in Revelation 13 that a first beast arrives and uh, everyone will marvel and follow and follow the beast according to chapter 13 verse 3. Now I'm not saying uh, who the Antichrist is or whatever at the moment, but I'm just showing you the spirit. I want to show you the spirit as well and truly Out there. So, chapter 13, verse 4, it says, They worship the dragon who gave authority to the beast, and they worship the beast, saying, Who is like the beast and who is able to make war with him? That's the first beast. And in verse 5, it says, He was given a mouth to speak great things and blasphemies, and he was given authority to continue for 42 months. Then he opened his mouth and blasphemy against God to blaspheme his name, his tabernacle, and those who dwell in heaven. Now, down further, we see that. A second beast arises. In verse 11 it says, Then I saw another beast coming up out of the earth, and he had two horns like a lamb, and spoke like a dragon, and he exercises all the authority of the first beast in his presence, and causes the earth and those who dwell in it to worship the first beast whose deadly wound was healed. Now we know also, I'm sure everyone knows down further, where we're talking about the mark of the beast. And in verse 18, it says, Here is wisdom. Let him who has understanding calculate the number of the beast, for it is the number of a man. His number is 666. So I'm not here to say so-and-so is the Antichrist is causing people to worship um, the beast and the dragon. But what I want to show you is the spirit, because what we're seeing here from that second beast it um, speaks like a dragon but has two horns like a lamb. That is a religious spirit. And Antichrist doesn't just mean opposing Christ. It can mean a replacement for Christ, a false Christ, in other words. So now I just want to play a couple of clips to show you clearly how I see this is being done. Let's look at New York and Kathy Hochul the unelected governor of New York. I prayed a lot to God during this time. And you know what? God did answer our prayers. He made the smartest men and women, the scientists, the doctors, the researchers, he made them come up with a vaccine. 